Well, Hamilton is home to many famous faces. When it comes to hockey, none more so than former player and coach Pat Quinn. He played for four NHL teams, coached for four, including the Leafs, winning coach of the year twice and leading our men's uh, hockey team to Olympic gold in 2002. Coming up on Saturday, there's going to be a rededication ceremony on the rink that bears his famous name. And great to have his brother, Barry Quinn, uh, with us this morning on the couch to have some memories about the big Irishman, and he's, as he was known, uh, Pat Quinn. Great to, yeah. great to meet you, Barry. Good to meet you. Why, um, why are we rededicating the, the rink once again? Yeah. Well, what happened? Uh, it, the rink was uh, dedicated in 2005. And uh, at that time, a banner was presented to Pat uh, that revolved around the 2002 Olympics. I got a phone call from Scott Radley, said, the banner's missing, Barry, where did it go? And he said, uh, the Endertruck banner's hanging in there, but the Quinn's gone. So I went up to look at the Endertruck arena to see whether the Quinn banner might be hanging up there. <laughs> <laughs> That's the, this is the banner right here? That's the banner. Okay. That's right. So the mystery of the banner, and, and, sh and shout out to, to Scott for, for writing a couple articles ab about this. Was the banner ever found? Banner was never found. Uh, two businesses came forth and said, we want to reprint the banner. What we did is we reprinted the banner that you saw earlier and another one from the Hall of Fame. And uh, th they're hanging uh, alongside of a 15-foot mural that's been painted by Scott McDonald. And uh, that, that mural is really key in the whole arena today. Well, because this kind of accelerated everything with you going into the arena. And yeah, the, the arena bears this name, but for, for any young hockey players, them walking in there to the Pat Quinn Arena, if they don't know it Pat Quinn, bare. you wouldn't know anything about. No, the arena was bare. I walked ah. in, there was nothing there at all. And uh, so I got a hold of uh, Jim Brush at, over here across the street. Harry, uh, Harry Howell Arena. Harry Howell Arena. And I saw what they had done to Harry Howell Arena and magnificent. Uh, he said, let's do the same thing in the Pat Quinn Arena. And it's all been coming together. The community's been coming together. Uh, Councillor uh, uh, Tammy Wang yeah. uh, is right behind this whole thing. That's her area. And uh, she's been behind this whole thing and helping it happen. On uh, Saturday, this Saturday, yeah. we've got a uh, few players coming out. And they, uh, that, that mural is going to be unveiled by Tammy on the, uh, on the 16th. Everyone's welcome. We got uh, Mike Pellet coming out. Yeah. We got uh, uh, Geraldine Heaney. Yeah, Geraldine. Jim uh, Taddy's going to be there. He's yeah. the MC of it. Joe Bowen. Oh, awesome. Bowen's yeah. going to be there. Good. Yeah. Why, did, why, does, why does the rinks mean so much to you personally, Barry? That rink there and where it is. Well, it was at the top of our street. We, we cut our, uh, our skates uh, into that ice many, many times. Pat played CYO hockey there. We skated there quite often. And uh, it means a lot to us. It's right in our backyard. And uh, it meant a lot to Pat when they named it after him. What a great, uh, what a great thing for Pat. If anybody doesn't know Pat, the young person watching, what made Pat so special? Just Pat. He was just, uh, he, he loved Hamilton. And, uh, and he was just, Pat Quid was the same way when he died as he was when he was uh, my age growing up, uh, you know, in, in East End Hamilton. He never forgot Hamilton. He never forgot the East End. He was just a really down-to-earth guy. Yeah, and I can't believe it. So it's n coming up on nine years. Nine he died, years. Died in yeah. 20, 2014. November, yeah. And obviously with him uh, associated with the Leafs, he's, uh, he's a, a legend in Hamilton. But yeah. right he got around. to play, got yeah. to coach. And, and that was unfortunate. He didn't get to stay on there and yeah. get himself a Stanley Cup. But anybody can go. Anybody can go to this anybody rededication ceremony. It's this coming uh, Saturday at the, uh, the Pat Quinn, uh, at the Pat Quinn Arena. So the time's there. It starts at 11. It goes until, uh, goes until 2 o'clock. So Saturday, September the uh, 16th, uh, featuring special guests and players and uh, as his brother Barry said the unveiling of that big massive mural that will be there in the Pat Quinn arena forever thanks so much Barry okay Good everybody's stuff. gonna get one of these anyways awesome yeah. thanks Barry yeah.